Hi friends, in this video we are going to discuss about the do while loop in C. So we can use do while loop in cases where we want to execute a block of statements at least once. Now this is the syntax of do while loop. Do, then write statements within curly braces and then while condition semicolon. Now let us see how do while works. So it will execute the statements first and then check the condition. And if it is true, the statements will be executed again and then it will check the condition again. Suppose it is true again. So the statements will be executed and condition will be checked. Now suppose the condition is false. So it will come out of the loop. So in each iteration, the statements will be executed first and then condition will be checked. Now let us see a simple C program which gets an input from the user and print it until the input is 100. So we have the main function and an integer variable num is created. And then we have our do while loop here. And in each iteration it reads the input, store it to num and print it and then check if it is not equal to 100. So we go to first iteration, we ask the user to give a number and suppose user enters 12. So it will be printed and the condition is checked which is true. So we go for the second iteration and ask the user for a number and let it be 10 now. And it will be stored in num and it will be printed. Now the condition is checked and it is still true. So we go for the third iteration and we ask the user for the input and let the number entered by the user be 100. Now it will be stored in num and it will be printed and now the condition will be checked and it fails. So the control comes out of the loop and execute the next statement which is written 0 here. And the major difference between while and do while loop is that while loop will check the condition first and if it is true then the block will be executed. And do while will execute the block first then check the condition. Hi guys. Now you can get a lot of features in the official log to base 2 website, easy registration and login process. And once you log in, you can access a lot of amazing courses. You can watch the visual tutorials, you can see the examples, solve puzzles and finally practice problems, all in a single page. Visit www.log2base2.com where learning is fun and beautiful. And don't forget to let us know your thoughts on this.